Yeah, we're here in uh, Feathertown Park today for uh, an open training session and we've uh, use of a great facility down here. So the seniors are training on the grass pitch there behind us and uh, we have a center here for the, for the kids. So uh, tiring us out for the last hour with kicking balls and jumping on bouncy castles and skill tests and pass tests. So great fun here. And, and of course we have the uh, synthetic pitch in, in there as well, which we use quite regularly for our uh, development squads training down here. So great facilities here in Feathertown Park and we're absolutely delighted to be here today to, to utilize them. It's great to have a facility like this on their doorstep. Uh, Feathered Rugby Club is uh, just up the road. That's obviously been a, a fantastic club uh, over the last couple of years, building their facilities. And then um, I suppose they, they got really lucky when Feathertown Park um, planning went in and they got, they got used to this facility. So hopefully it will encourage uh, a lot of the community here to play more and I suppose hopefully grow the rugby community. And we might see more, more players in, um, in the Feathered Colours in years to come. Yeah, they're fantastic. Uh, it's been my first time down here training and it's been great to get out here. The, the numbers have been unreal. It's been a great buzz around the place and yeah, really delighted to be here because it's so close to home. Tipperary would be more known for its hurling and, and GA, but to see this amount of kids interested in rugby and, and following us is, is very humbling and yeah, it's been unreal. Going to things like this when I was younger anyway definitely encouraged me to pick up rugby ball and and created a buzz around rugby because it's not it's not the number one sport here and, and in saying that though it's it's an extremely popular sport and people that support Munster are are very passionate about it so it's it's unreal.